Hey, Mark Rice here, and today I will show you how to draw a simple pirate character. It will be amazing if you want to use it for video animation, maybe some children book, or just for avatar. And if you want to download all other characters from this series and use it for your commercial projects, check out the link in the video description. So let's start. Okay, so first I will pick up the skin color from my palette. Okay, and draw just small part of the face. Beautiful. And now the most important part of the character, a beard. And it will be tricky a bit, but it's easy in the same time. You will see. First I will draw the big circle. Okay. And it will be black. Then I will copy it, change the size, okay, and move it here. So you need to be precise and hit that anchor point here. Okay. Now select the rotate tool or just hit air on the keyboard. Find the center here. Hold out and hit it. Okay, beautiful. Here, I don't know. Maybe I can use 30. We will see. No, no, no. Maybe 15. Okay. It's better now. And hit that copy button. Let me check. That's it. Repeat the process with Ctrl plus D command. Dug, 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 dug. Okay, beautiful. So this is the lower part of the beard. And now for the upper part, I will copy this part here. So hold out, then shift, move it here. Okay. And repeat the process with Ctrl plus D. Something like this. Select these shapes. Group it. Ctrl plus C. Paste it with Ctrl plus F. And move it here. Okay, beautiful. Group all the shapes. Let me check. That's it. Send to back. And do something like this. Okay, beautiful. So, I need to fill this gap here. And it will be very easy. I will copy this line here. Control C. Control F. Rotate it. Move it here. Okay, something like this. And I don't need these circles here, so just delete it. And here I will draw the rectangle. Basically that's it with the beard. As you can see it's tricky a bit, but it's not so hard. Okay, now the mouth. For that I will need the semicircle. So first I will create the circle and cut the upper part. Okay. Like this. I need the red color for it. And these corners will be round. Okay, beautiful. I need one more shape here for the teeth. It will be white, of course. And make these corners round as well. Okay, something like this. And here I need a thumb. And I will use light red color for it. Okay, beautiful. Now I need to cut this part, so copy the basic shape of the mouth, Ctrl C, Ctrl F, select it together with the light part, and here in the Pathfinder use the Y tool. Ungroup and delete everything except this part here. Okay, maybe this color can be darker a bit. Not bad. And here I need to put the gold. <laughs> Group the shapes with Ctrl plus G command and move it here and increase the size, of course. Okay, cool. Now the pirate hat. So for that, I will need a semicircle. Okay, and I need to pick up the color from the gigantic master colors. Maybe I can start, I don't know, with this one. It can be cool. Okay, beautiful. Here, draw one more rectangle. It will be darker a bit. And now, select these corners and this corner. Okay, something like this. But I will move these points here. And increase the size for this shape. Send to back, let me check. Okay, I will change the color. That's it. Maybe I can change the size. Now it's better. I will copy it, Ctrl C, Ctrl F, move it here and reflect it. So, click with the right mouse button 
go here into transform and choose reflect. Select a vertical and hit OK. And basically that's it. And here we can add a small detail. I think that it can be better with it. So it will be something like that. Okay. Here I will draw the circle. Okay, something like this. Copy it, move it here, crop it. Okay, I like it. And here I'll draw one more detail, something like a bone. Okay. You can add more detail if you want, but I will use this one for the avatar. So I need a lower number of the details. That's it. Group the shapes and move it here. But before that, I will change the size. Haha. <laughs> okay. Cool. Here I need one more part. It will be red. Okay. I'll copy it and change the color for the copied shape. Something like this. And here this will be the most important detail for the pirate. Okay, something like this. Group the shapes. Going to front. Okay, so now I need a second eye or the first eye. <laughs> something like this. Make these corners round and select these shapes here and group it. Because I need these shapes in the front. And I will create the nose. It will be very simple. Something like this. But I will bring the front the mouth and this part of the beard as well. Okay, now this will be tricky with the eyes. So I will do that without eye and then I will back eye here. And I will move this shape here as well. Something like this. Okay, now the ears. Something like this. I just created the big ear. Send to back. Copy it. And here I can add a few details as well. More gold. Okay, so basically this is the head. I will group the shapes and here I will draw just a small part of the body. So it will be the rectangle. Something like this. Okay, these corners needs to be rounded. And here I will cut this part for the t-shirt. And it will be blue. Something like this. Okay, Pathfinder, the white, ungroup, delete this part this part and I think that it will be cool if I add white lines here or light blue or something like that let me check okay not bad haha <laughs> copy it and repeat action with control plus D okay now I will cut the brown parts with control plus X select these parts and use the white ungroup Delete these parts and these parts. Group the rest of the shapes with Ctrl plus G. And paste cutted part of the character with Ctrl plus F. Group the shapes. Change the size. Move it here. Something like this. And send to back. Okay. And that's it. 